What about your uh, teammate Jordan Lewis? Uh, uh, both ways. I, mean, oh, he, I don't know why they haven't been letting Jordan play both ways. You know, Jordan's one of the craziest athletes I ever seen. You know, uh, it's, you know, we 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 definitely favor each other a lot. You know what I'm saying? But we just have different body types and you know playing styles. But you know, just Jordan could be just as efficient on offense as he is on defense. And you know, I've covered him. He's covered me. You know, so. You know, we speak from experience when we say that. Like, you know, people can have trouble with Jordan on offense just as they do on defense. So, you know, I hope they give him a shot. You know, it'd be nice to have a, you know, uh, fellow fellow defensive man over there. But, you know, it is what it is. You know, I, I just hope they give him a shot. But at the end of the day, you know, uh, we may not need him over there. They may need him over there. So you never know. You know, it's always wrenches we could throw in there. So we just like to keep the opposition guessing. Who's faster? So if you were just meeting somebody, and they said, you said you played football, and I asked, what position do you play? Mm -hmm. What would you say? i just say athlete. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really get to specifics. You know, I try to stay under the radar. So if they don't know I play football, they wouldn't know. Right. You know I don't really, you know, wear a lot of Michigan stuff. You know, I just kind of just stay low. You know, I didn't really ask for any of the, the fame stuff. You know, I just wanted to just play ball so my mama didn't have to pay for college. You know, but this is stuff that comes with it. So, you know, you got to handle it the right way, and, you know, make sure you keep your nose clean and do what you have to do. The, the strength and conditioning job did a great job pushing us, you know, take, taking us places where we thought we couldn't take ourselves. And, you know, it's, it's definitely paid off, and the team was great. What's the fastest 40 time you've ever had or recently? Well, when we clocked, it was hand time. It was a 4-3-1. So that's probably like a 4-4 four, four something, 4-4-5-ish. Four, four, you know, you got to add two temps. So I don't know, but it was hand time, you know, clock 4-3-1. So, you know, I felt pretty good about when that. When was that? Uh, I think I saw something on Twitter yes, or somewhere. Yeah, I, don't, I can't so remember. So whenever that, that was, Yes, that was yes, legit. yes. So you can look at that tweet. It yeah, is from that day. There's, there's the timestamp. Um, <laughs> Coach talked about today that he could see you playing 95, 100 snaps. What was the most you played last year? Do you know? I think it was the Minnesota game. Uh, what was it like 96? I think. I don't. Right. I don't really and the, does that sound like a good number to you? Can you handle uh, that? Whatever we got to do to win. You know, that's what I tell them. You know, I'm bored in. The guys around me are bored in, and uh, you know, each and every one of us will do whatever it takes for us to get a W, man. Right. That's just a, that's just our mo around here. And that could include being a decoy, knowing you're not going to oh, get absolutely. the ball. Oh, absolutely. You know, that's people are that's at the you. best part about everything. You know, you. That's why I like to work on my acting, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, you know, definitely being a decoy, definitely one of my favorite things. You know, I think I actually play harder when, I, when I'm a decoy, but <laughs> now nah, I'm playing. But, uh, yeah, man, just doing whatever we could do, man, just help the team. You said the goal was so your mom wouldn't have to pay for college. So you've accomplished that. What's the goal now? Uh, you know, to make sure. I, how I look at it is, you know, I've made it already. You know, I'm going, I, I, I made it to college, you know, I made it to like, a, a historic, you know, university. Like University of Michigan, and uh, you know, people where I'm from, you know, they don't, they don't have this opportunity. So you know, this in a, this, this in alone is, you know, I, I've made it for my circumstances. Now what I do here is, you know, show guys that it's other ways to, you know, get where you want to be without, you know, following, this, uh, without following, you know, the usual, you know, statistical path that you know people where I'm from follow. So you know, just, just being motivation for the guys who look up to me. That's really, it, you know, what I'm saying everything else will fall in, fall in. To place if I take care of what I have to take care of. So, you know, that's how I, that's how I go. You're hard walking, so what you mean? You decided to sit down, to sit down and rice and rice? Uh, <laughs> now nah, he didn't consult me on that. He didn't consult me on that. I might have, I might have. I actually haven't heard it yet. Are you talking about that video? Yeah. <laughs> I, I was laughing for two days straight when I saw that video, man. I don't know why they had him on there like that. <laughs> But, uh, but that's Coach Harbaugh, man. He loves his job. You know, we love him. He loves to have fun, man. So, hey, I'm all for it. I have to say you didn't commit to that. You committed to the previous step. But is there something about what Harbaugh and this step have done to change your game and to I mean, um, have you developed differently under them, do you think? Uh, well, I'm healthy. Um, you know, that's, that definitely is a, a big part of everything. And, you know, he brought a lot of guys in with, you know, tremendous backgrounds who numbers speak for themselves, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, the, the NFL quality coaches that he's brought in, you know, just expanded, you know, not only my game, but even my mental aspect of it, you know, that's a big part. Who in particular? Uh, you know, all the coaches, you know, all the coaches that, you know, he brought in, you know, some aren't here anymore, but, Jackson, you're yeah, yep, yep, you know, Coach Baxter, you know, some aren't here anymore, in, but, you know, we, we definitely, you know, still hold precedent to what they said, you know, some of the things they taught us was, you know, very good knowledge of the game, and, you know, being a, being a student of the game is half the battle, man, so, you know, that's where, that, that's, that's just, you know, how we try to do things.